Hey there guys, so I thought I'd make a quick video on this Fury vs U6 situation. Um, who knows if the fight will actually happen or not. Um, it's been in negotiations for months since Tyson Fury beat Derek Chisora. Um, and apparently Tyson Fury has rejected um, a 60-40 split in favour of him. Um, and the fight's looking unlikely. So first of all, um, this is Tyson Fury and um, negotiations involving Tyson Fury and his team. Um, there's always something like this that happens. In, his, in the negotiations for the Dillian White fight, um, there was a lot of it was there was a lot of problems in the negotiations for that fight. Um, that fight was it was on and then it was off and then it was on and then it was off. Um, no one really knew whether it was going to happen or not. Um, and there was just a lot of problems in the negotiating. So um, this is usual for Tyson Fury um, when he's negotiating negotiating for a fight. Um, there's always pr there's usually problems involved, um, and as well Tyson Fury could just be negotiating a higher purse split. Maybe he wants seventy thirty, um, and maybe he's holding off agreeing until he uh, gets a more favourable split. So um, I don't think he's avoiding new sick as some are saying. Um, I think it's likely that the fight will happen, um, whether it's now or at some point down the line. Um, because who else is he going to fight? Um, Usyk, the Usyk fight is obviously the one that's going to gain him the most revenue and it's the fight that's going to have the most eyes on it. Um, I mean, the Joshua fight has lost its value. I mean, Joshua, he's not really doing anything with his career. He's just cherry-picking Jermaine Franklin. Um, and obviously, it's been, what, a year and a half since he was actually champion. So, um, and apart from that, there's not really any... Um, high profile big money fights for Tyson Fury to make so I expect him to take the Usyk fight um, but if that fight doesn't happen for whatever reason um, whether Fury doesn't want the fight or whether um, negotiations just break down um, apparently he is going to be fighting at Wembley on April 29th regardless um, and there's been a few opponents that I've seen um, you know their names bounded about one is Andy Ruiz um, <laughs> that fight's a mismatch um, Andy Ruiz is no better than a prime Derek Chisora um, he got a lucky win over well, well I wouldn't call it lucky but um, he got a win over you know a guy like Joshua who was never really a great champion um, and Joshua probably underestimated him and um, he won the rematch regardless, so um, I'd, I've never really seen Andy Ruiz as a great fighter. Um, in his last fight, he massively struggled against a 50-year-old Luis Ortiz, um, struggled with the skills of Luis Ortiz, and um, that version of Luis Ortiz is completely shot, and he's been finished for years. Um, and it's debatable whether Andy Ruiz actually won that fight or not, despite scoring a few knockdowns. Um, and then in the, uh, before that fight in his fight against Chris Ariola, um, he got dropped in that fight by a shot Chris Ariola, um, and didn't exactly look great. Um, so I think Fury would demolish Andrew Ruiz. Um, it would be no more competitive than the Chisora fights. Um, and it's just a pointless fight in my opinion. Um, but if Fury is going to fight anyone, um, apart from Usyk on the 29th of April, I think he should fight Joe Joyce. Um, now obviously Joe Joyce has a fight lined up against Zili Zhang, um, but that's not really a problem. We've seen fighters being pulled from fights um, to fight, you know, to be in bigger fights. Um, we've seen that plenty of times before. Um, and obviously Joe Joyce is with um, Queensbury like um, Tyson Fury, so it should be easy enough to make that fight. Um, and Joe Joyce is probably Apart from Usyk, he's probably Tyson Fury's toughest fight in the heavyweight division. Um, he can match Tyson Fury for size. Um, he weighs just as much. He's almost as tall. Um, he's almost got as long a reach. Um, Joe Joyce has a very difficult style. 
Um, he's obviously he comes forward, throws a lot of punches. He's heavy-handed, um, very durable, very strong. Um, and yeah, he would give Tyson Fury a lot of problems. Um, and I favor Tyson Fury to win the fight. I think he would probably outbox Joe Joyce. Um, but uh, yeah, that's the fight that they should make as Joe Joyce could give Tyson Fury his toughest fight to date. Um, and obviously he would he would come to win unlike you know Derek Chisora in the last fight who was just sort of there to survive um, and yeah um, that's the fight I would like to see if Tyson Fury is gonna fight anyone other than Usyk so yeah just wanted to make a quick video on this whole Fury Usyk situation hopefully the fight happens but um, it's looking unlikely for the moment so yeah thanks for watching guys and God bless